morning guys y'all know what it is it's winning as car wash owner Brian Ducky. and today today I don't really know exactly what all I'm gonna get into that y'all gonna see but I know that I'm really upset with myself because yesterday I didn't do any uh, vlogging for you guys but uh uh, that was due to me, man. It's been a lot of stuff going on as far as like I'm like focusing on the business and stuff like that. And I told myself, like you know, I really wanted to go hard with uh, YouTube and this year for winning this car wash because you know y'all need to see this content. But basically, um, what I'm gonna try to do is like the the thing that's been making it hard that done slowed me down from doing a video a day is. Uh, YouTube, man. I don't know. It's like my internet connection or something. So if anybody uh, got any um, remedies for the the, the fact that uh, my videos are taking so long to load up, but I think it's because of how long it is and stuff like that. Um, but and it could be my home service. I don't know. But we definitely gotta get that fixed. So it ain't that I ain't on on top of my game is just certain things is messing me up and, and slowing me down you know so between that and um being able to contact you know massive amounts of people at one time to go ahead and set up the services and stuff because like, i actually was able to figure out a way to get you know more um more employees and stuff like that um for winning edge car wise so ended up getting about like 60 or so applications so far right now so i just got to put all these people to work and uh we'll be good so we just working on it every day we got to keep figuring out things and uh making it happen man so uh let me turn this uh radio off before i get that copyright but uh at the end of the day we out here working hard we going hard um I still feel like it's gonna be a good week, you know what I'm saying? Even though it's a lot of things that's uh, bugging me and bothering me and stuff like that. Well, we about to, uh, about to work it out. Gotta go find these dirty cars and uh, get them washed up, get them clean. Uh, right now, it's, uh, we, I wouldn't say I'm running behind. Um, it's kind of cold today, so, you know, we try to start a little bit later than eight, cause uh, it'd be like pretty, pretty tough. Like, especially if you go outside, and you see ice on the equipment and stuff like that um so like i said we in florida so we can detail all year round it's just about what time of the day it is so all that super early morning like i mean in the summertime we could do like 7 a.m if we, if we want like you know as soon as soon as day day um like is up and ready you know what i'm saying we can start detailing in the summertime um but in the winter time we gotta wait a little while before we uh before we start, before we start detailing, cause it be it be too cold, you know what I'm saying? Especially we Floridians, you know what I'm saying? We don't like the cold at all, anyway, you know. So, but anyhow, I right now have to go to Walmart. The worst thing probably ever could have happened this morning, which I found out like my Bluetooth, the speaker though. The Bluetooth speaker done went out on me, so I'm headed to Walmart so I can do the old swap a room. Get me another one, and um, I gotta have that Bluetooth because people gonna be calling me, and I can't be holding my phone all day. My hands gotta be free, so that's a priority right now. I'll go get a Bluetooth, and then I need to go grab me some food real quick because I skipped my little breakfast routine and stuff today because I really needed to figure out some stuff on the computer then man i had yesterday i had a customer hit me up talk, like literally we did this customer's car on a thursday they hit us up monday complaining saying oh y'all missed some spots and this and that what's wrong with you bro what the heck you tripping bro you tripping <laughs> and i'm like sir like we love like far now this was something that joe did but like i say i'll tell anybody i have full confidence in joe that he didn't mess up so that being said um the customer was complaining and i'm like yo like we love like y'all checked it out he was like he wasn't there i guess he left his son to look at it the son approved of it or whatever so really and truly i guess he should have been mad at his son and not us for uh okaying it and whatnot but all in all why would you call me on monday stop it get some help 
I don't know what you got. If we did it on Thursday, you got Friday, Saturday, Sunday, um, Monday. Yo, so like four days later, complaining about the job? Come on. <laughs> Come on now. Now, me being me, like, I really wasn't happy about it. I did kind of show him my frustration um, when I was talking to him. But I did let him know, like, hey, you know, Winning Edge Car Wash is a company that we don't want to have any bad vibes or any bad uh, service um, or people out there talking bad on our name and stuff like that. So I did agree to go check it out and look at it. But really and truly, I <laughs> ain't too much I'm like concerned about because it's like, buddy, you called me four days later. I don't know if you done took this thing to the beach and you trying to get over or what, but. We'll see. And then the other thing about it is too, I tried to go early this morning to go look at it. He telling me he don't even have the vehicle. So like it ain't even hit, ain't even in his possession right now to get to. So it's a lot of discrepancy right now. And I'm not really too happy about the, uh, the discrepancy of the situation. But uh, I do got to get in contact with Joe and uh, see what's going on with the job he at right now um because the location is a little funny and um the last time we was at that location we got the police called on us because the guy i don't know man you got some weird people in this world but this guy he just had to have a portion of the sidewalk or something like that and you know the person who parked the truck on there told us it was okay, which was the resident. But this guy felt the, ne the necessary need to call the police on us because he felt like we shouldn't have been there and he had to use that part of the sidewalk, whatever, whatever. But if you would have seen where we was at and where he could have went to get where to where he was trying to go, you would have been like, this man is crazy, which he was. And the police actually gave us the okay to finish up what we was doing, so that's what we did. But, you know, that was, that was like a little backstory. but at the end of the day, uh, let's, uh, Let's give Joe a call and go from there and I'll see what we gotta do for the rest of the day. But let me make this call, I'm gonna get back with y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, we leaving Walmart. I was able to go grab that Bluetooth real quick, but I was on the phone with Joe, trying to get everything figured out. Got the customer outside, ready to go. And uh, we gonna make it happen. Um, if y'all ever need a good Bluetooth, just the one to get, so. Check it out. What's up, y'all? Y'all see we at Chick-fil-A. About to go in and grab this uh, food real quick. And then get it over here to uh, Joe, where we uh, got some work set up. And uh, keep it going for the rest of the day. I don't know how much I'm doing today, because uh, I still got some computer work to do, but we'll figure it out as we go along. What's up, y'all? We back. We over here uh, at the Scobble Homes uh, subdivision. Got my boy Joe over here working hard. Taking care of the yards. So we knocking them down as usual today. Um, I got a lot of stuff to do as far as like getting everything done for the rest of the week, of course. But y'all know what to do, man. Hit us up. Winning Edge Car Wash. Um, check out the website, winningedgecarwash.com. What you got going on, Joe? You good? Yeah. What's up? Yeah. We just had to work on the outside? Uh, you ain't did none of them on the inside yet, right? Yeah, I done did inside. You already did it? Yeah. Oh, you done? Dang. Yeah, that's what's up. Yeah, you already did the outside. Yeah, that's what's up. Yeah, Joe been on it, so we gonna get ready to go to the second one here in a minute. Um, had Betty, uh, dang, I forgot her name. I know her name, Betty, or something like that. But, uh, yeah, so today is an office day for me, pretty much. Um, I ain't doing too much work unless I, like, really have to because I got a bunch of stuff that I need to still figure out with uh, moving forward with uh, hiring uh, new people and whatnot. So, just giving y'all that content, man. Every day we, we switching switching uh different cars and this is you know doing different customer cars and stuff like that you know we always get a new clientele and the business still going well it is really cold and windy today um i just got off the phone with my cousin richard that owns uh that morning glory uh 
well, I think it's Hope and Morning Glory, uh, pressure washing. But I uh, just got off the phone with him. He said he inside. Say he inside the house today um, because it's a little too cold for him, and I definitely agree. And uh, I definitely appreciate Joe coming to work today because. Not that it's too cold for me to work, but if I was working, I probably would be complaining about the cold, definitely, because uh, when we're working in this water. But as y'all can see, you know, I know if you're um, in a colder climate place, uh, y'all definitely ain't washing no cars like we do over here in Florida, because I'm sure as soon as the, the water probably would be melted in, the, I mean, not melted, but <laughs> see, see how much I'm, I stay in Florida, but like the, the, the water probably would have ice in the tank or something like that i'm guessing over there in uh them colder colder regions and stuff like that because uh y'all got snow i mean i ain't never seen no snow being real like i just haven't been in a place that has snow um you know during the colder uh parts of the year so that's definitely something i need to do i think i've always wanted to snowboard so i'm gonna figure that out i do not skateboard but skateboarding is definitely so much floridians um do because it stayed, it stayed the right temperature for us to be outside. And that's where we at. We outside. But it's a little cold and windy today, like I said. But um, we're going to uh, continue to knock this out and uh, move on to the next thing. Um, like I say, we out here, man. Y'all support us. Y'all like, share, subscribe to these videos. You know what I'm saying? And comment. And uh, we just trying to go to the top. What's going on today is feeling very problematic. Um, I've been sitting here trying to figure out what's up with my phone. I'm trying to get some work done and, you know, I don't know if it's because I'm just in the country or what, but the internet service is slow. You know, I pay all this money to Verizon and they, they just can't get it right. Um, it's making it hard for me to do my job. And it's weird because they talking about I got 5G on my phone right now, but for some reason stuff ain't pulling up how I want it to be pulled up. I got customers who kind of hooked me from yesterday. I was waiting on their information, so I don't have like a lot of cancellations today. Um, a lot of people that I thought was going to be uh, ready to go, but apparently they're not. So we definitely got to work hard on uh, getting more people in the pipeline and stuff like that. And, making it a lot more uh, guaranteed so I don't know exactly what to do with this situation like especially the people that had me thinking like they was good to go and then they end up not being good to go so it is what it is man like I'm gonna keep it going I literally I, I just got off the phone with somebody saying that you know they was like yeah send me the information request uh, text and I was like yo why you ain't why you send us the information yet? Oh, well, uh, I figured the price is too high, so I'm gonna do it myself. Okay, cool. Tell me that so I know not to like not to put you in the slot and think like my day is good. Like you know, we already we already discussed pricing and all that stuff on the phone. Like the least you can do is just not have me on the hook for the next day. And what's the name? Have me thinking like we coming to you and we not. You know what I'm saying? Like it's. You know, it's just simple courtesy, you know what I'm saying? But this is, this is the world we live in. Um, so I must admit, like, the day ain't one of my, like, upbeat days where I'm just happy, everything going the right way. Like, it's cold. Um, I still ain't figured out something that I'm trying to, like, put my time into figuring out and stuff like that. So it's kind of hard for me right now because I'm trying to keep my morale up so that I don't bring uh you know joe morale down and stuff like that but my main goal today really now is to just make sure he get his money and everything get paid for equipment wise today but um we definitely gonna continue to work hard and uh make it happen but i know for sure like once i get my system down and stuff like that we're gonna be golden because like i say all the time like you know, we definitely got um, the way that we wash the cars and how we service people down pat. It's just all about like finding the people who 
are motivated to get their cars detailed um, on a daily basis. Um, I literally, I definitely want to get up to about like 2,800 bucks a day um, with detailing and stuff like that. You know, on average, I always say, you know, we do about like 700 to 1,300 a day um, with detailing and stuff like that. But it just be some of them days, man, it'll be harder than others. Like, just, I don't know. It's, you gotta get your feelings out of it a lot of times to keep going strong but some days your feelings do get involved and it's hard to keep going strong so i got a lot of stuff i need to check on that are that, that's wrong at the time being um about to make a phone call as well uh, one of my trucks and stuff that's been in the shop for like literally four months so you know i gotta gotta see what's going on with that like why you don't have my truck for four months you know what i'm saying no word no call no nothing so we'll see what's going on with that um hopefully we can get that out of the shop soon and pay some old bills with the money that's coming in because you know them bills don't stop but we're pressing hard to keep going to find that 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 great niche that great thing where like you know every day is a good day well i will say like every day ain't a good day because i mean i'm blessed lord don't want me up like i'm good you know what i'm saying but some days i just be agitated at like the little things that's going on that i ain't got no control over of course but it's gonna happen so we're gonna keep moving man i'm gonna I'm i know i'm gonna make myself feel better this day and i'm gonna keep pressing it. so you know y'all stay tuned know that we're gonna keep bringing bringing y'all some good stuff and uh we're good to go well guys we are going to a different location now I uh, literally the, the customer put us in the wrong direction all right guys we over in these apartment complexes um you know sometimes when we in these apartment complexes the spacing is really uh, hard to get right but uh We'll go find a little spot. As you can see, I'm walking back over here to help Joe out with getting the vehicle back toward uh, the area where we can detail it at. Got this uh, Hyundai Voyster. About to go grab it. Got the customer right here. Make it happen. Good morning. You okay with you okay with the camera? All right, cool. Got Miss Betty here. Got her cool car. I'm gonna do. I gotta give you a price on it still. Let's see what it's looking like. So it's pretty clean, honestly. Cool. Yeah, we could just do a fresh note detail on this. It's not dirty, except for uh, you got a little couple of scuff marks and stuff right there, but should be good. Right, oh yep, we'll, we'll use the uh, regular soap on it, but cool. This is my son's car. Yeah. Let me see where it is. It might have a little thing on the uh, key to do it too. There it is right there. Ah, here, here. Oh, the hood. <laughs> okay, gotcha. So he wanted the engine in too. Let me see. You tell me. Yeah, I mean, we could go over it and get all that stuff out. Yeah. So it ain't um it ain't horrible. So if we're gonna do that, then I would probably just um charge out for a starter detail. It's like 120. Is that okay? Okay. All right. And you include everything. Though. Yeah, yeah, that'll be going through the whole thing and uh, dusting it. Getting a little scuff marks and uh, hitting the engine real quick. It ain't going to be no okay, big deal. But cool. All right. Thank you. Thank we'll give you. you. Yeah, we'll give you a call in a minute. If I, if I'm not here to uh, check you out, um, the, the other truck, it got Joe in there. So he, um, how did you want to pay today? Uh, can, can be with check or have yeah, yeah, yeah. Check cash? Is, nah, check is fine. Okay. Yep. If you got a check, so uh, you can just write it out as 120 to win an edge car wash and we good. Okay. All right. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. So Have a good day. Bye. Yes, ma'am. All right. So, uh, price this one out real quick. This one wasn't too bad. It's got a little something, something. 
in the cup holder or whatever but you know anytime i see a vehicle and it's like super clean and whatnot that's when we use the uh starter detail or the uh Music off, man. These new cars we have in these crazy uh, sounds and whatnot. Ooh. But yo, yeah, anytime I see like a real clean car and whatnot, we could just dust through and uh, make it look good, hit it with the, the proper wash and stuff like that, you know? I'm not gonna hit you, you know what I'm saying? A lot of these people, they be thinking I'm tr overcharging them and stuff like that, but I get in their cars and they have all these like spots and stuff everywhere that I gotta use my uh, strongest cleaner to get it right and whatnot. This how we coming though, like whenever we come to you, we don't need no water and electricity, all that stuff on the trailer. We just pull up, set up, and it's a go. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're doing that to make it easier, grab the end of that and then just uh, pull it all the way back. Yeah, I, that's what I was doing, but it ain't. Nah, see, you ain't gotta do that. Oh, the camera. Keep the camera on. All right, so this one, I just charged, it's just a, uh, Starter detail for 120, just run through it. Um, the, I'm gonna show you like the little stuff I see. Oh, and they won't with the um the engine. We gotta do the engine, but just pressure wash it. You ain't gonna have to like put no grease on it. Just hit it real quick, and then you ain't gotta um do the uh, door jams like spray them or nothing like that. Just wipe. Them. Go around here, unlock the thing. So like just that cup holder area, I should have I should have charged up for a standard detail because of the cup holder area. But you can see them little spots and stuff like that. But like I say, for the most part, the whole car you can just dust it down. Ain't really nothing else. It, like when I look, when you look in it, it's like super clean. So. Didn't even need to do it, but it's the other side had, and then in between the seats, I see a little bit of uh, something here and there. But like, it's clean though, you know. I just take and blow that, uh, blow them leaves and stuff out of there, and call it a day. And you can hit the house from there, cause uh. I got what you call it, that money in the uh, console. Oh, you did, you did do cash. Yeah. All right. Cool. But everything look good, straight. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna, um, she, um, what she probably gonna do is give you a check. Okay. And then, um, uh, we're good to go. Okay. I should've told her to go ahead and write it out, but I like for people to see the work before I get the money. So, you good. Yeah, man. Like I say, I got a bunch of stuff that I'm still working on with the company that I gotta go get on a computer and do some research on. And I also got um, my pre-solo exam. It's getting time for me to uh, fly the airplane by myself without my instructor. So I need to go do my exam and uh, get all that stuff situated. So it'll be good. Then I'm gonna have to run to the store later on the day, get some stuff that I need for the house, whatnot. So I'm about to go ahead and get up out of here. Joe, you good? So this is a this is a matte uh, wrap or something on here. So just use uh, the yellow soap. So sometimes whenever you uh, whenever you see like a matte or whatever, they use the wax wax soap to make the wrap. But other than that, you good. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, man. With that, just uh, 
um, close the door and just spray it real quick, make it look good. Uh, you know, okay. all right. Then make sure all that out of there. And you should be able to, should be able to do it in an hour or something like that. Right. I appreciate it. That's it. to grab this little bit of money out of the truck that we got in cash this morning. Today is one of them days I'm not too happy with. Got some people over here looking like they want a detail. They can show sure enough get it. trying to get my number, I just get you a car. and stuff it's on my website and then if anything if y'all don't shop with me go to my youtube and uh subscribe okay sounds All right. good well when you get the chance could you, hey it just sit right there that ford ranger i mean i already know like i don't yeah, even gotta look at it. it bro yeah because it's not that i don't think it's that bad but i'd like to get it done again so. yeah if it ain't that bad bro you're gonna be like it's gonna be at a starting price of like 80 it'll go up to 120 depending on like exactly what you want but i mean if it's clean Look at that freshen up of the starter detail on my website, and then if it's on the more dirtier side, then we'll hit you with the recommended detail. I got you. All right. Sure. No, for sure, man. I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, man. Thank y'all. Y'all yeah, have a good day. Yes, sir. Y'all see it. So hopefully um, it's early in the week. Hopefully there will be some uh, new customers that come through. And uh, you see, I got dang, my hat is all jacked up. But. So the thing about me, man, I don't really play no games when it comes to like the pricing and stuff like that. I just tell people to go to the website um, on winningedgecarwatch.com. We do got packages, pricing, like add-ons, all that stuff on there. So if you ever curious about anything, you can just hit the website and see it for yourself. We don't play no games. And when we pull up, y'all see what it is. It's an everyday grind for me, you know what I'm saying? As long as I'm feeling good. Yesterday, I was like a little emotional about some things that was going on in life and uh, with the business and stuff like that. So I ain't get out and do nothing, and that's bad on my behalf. But you know, some days when you go, when you always going hard and stuff like that, sometimes you do gotta take that moment to make sure like you okay. So. That's what I did yesterday, made sure I was okay, made sure I wasn't like overworking myself and stressed out or nothing like that, you know what I'm saying? So that's what we had to do. Um, we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna be doing nothing else besides just trying to make it to the top. So we definitely need y'all support, you know what I'm saying? Like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Can't say that enough, you know what I'm saying? Cause we definitely trying to get this, uh, this YouTube thing going in the right direction uh, with that because we feel like we got something to offer y'all but uh check us out man we're gonna keep it going for you